Hello, fifth grade. This is your teacher, Mr. Denergy. Today is going to be a very different video. I know that we said we were going to go to traits, but we will do traits in a few weeks. Um, this week, we are just going to focus back on fossils and we're going to be making our own fossils. Okay, so we're going to be making two kinds of fossils. So what you will need, um, you'll need some cardboard scissors, tape, a butter knife, crayons, and a piece of paper. Now this can be plain paper, it can be lined paper, it doesn't matter. The point of the paper is that we're going to also be doing a fossil rub, okay? Oh, and then you'll also need a marker to trace. So I want you to take your cardboard box, cut it into a very small rectangle, square, doesn't matter which shape, as long as it's pretty small. The first fossil we're going to make is going to be an impression of some form of plant. Now this can be any kind of plant you want. I'm just going to make a leaf. So I already traced my leaf, okay? doesn't have to look um, very good as long as it looks like it's a leaf. So now I'm going to take my tape and what I'm going to do is that I'm going to take my tape and I'm just going to outline my leaf. Okay, I'm going to start it but I've already done it. So I'm going to show you what I mean so you can cut the tape. Cut the tape. And then you're just going to go around the outline of what you drew, okay? Okay, and you're gonna do this all the way around and also inside. And it should look like this when you're done, okay? So it should look like this. And then I labeled mine and I said it was a leaf. Okay. All right. So then our second fossil is going to be um, some form of animal or some form of um, ob object from the ocean. So I chose to do a shell, okay? So I'm going to draw a shell on here. Doesn't have to look perfect. Okay, this is my shell. And then what I'm going to do is, I'm going to take my scissors first And then I'm just going to, and you probably need to do this supervised. I would have your parents around when you do this, especially when you use the butter knife too. Though it's not sharp, you can still cut yourself. So remember, we're still going to be like we're in a classroom and we're still going to use safety precautions. Now you might, you all may not have goggles, but I would make sure that you're not so close to it and that you're far away from it while you are going over the cardboard box with the scissors and the butter knife. So I'm just gonna take my scissors and I'm just gonna poke holes, poke holes in my cardboard because the poking holes is going to help me when I go back over it with the butter knife. You make sure you make several holes. And then I'm going to take my butter knife and I'm just going to go over my butter knife. Okay. And then even when I do this, I want to take it and I want to kind of like dig in it. Okay. So make sure that you're digging in. Make sure you dig in. Okay. Okay. And you're going to do that all around. So it should look like this. Yes, it's supposed to look really ugly. That's the whole point of it, okay? So I want you to do this all the way around and you're and it should look something like this, okay? 
So if you see right here, I probably need to go over some more with a butter knife. So that's exactly what I'm going to do. I'm going to take it and I'm just going to kind of twist it within the butter knife. Okay. All right, so this is this is as good as it's gonna get. And then I labeled it and I put seashell, okay? So this is my seashell fossil and this is my leaf fossil. So now we're going to start do the rubbings, okay? So I'm gonna start with my leaf. I'm gonna take my piece of paper and I'm going to cut it to about the size of where the leaf is at. I wouldn't do half a piece of paper because this leaf isn't half the piece of paper because you're going to use the other half of this to rub the shell. And if you don't, if you do half of it, then the half piece of paper is not going to cover the shell. So make sure you cut it the size of the cardboard. Okay. So, yep. So I'm going to take this piece of paper and I'm going to put it over my leaf. Okay. And then I'm going to take my crayons and I'm going to take the lightest color. Okay. I would take the lightest color and the lightest color is probably going to be like a blue or a green or an orange. So I'm going to use an orange. Okay. And then when I do my tracing, I'm going to make sure that I go over it lightly. Okay. So I'm done with my tracing, and this is what my tracing looks like. So in a way, it kind of looks just like the leaf, right? So we just did a fossil tracing. That's cool, right? So I'm going to label this leaf. Okay, I'm going to label this one the leaf. That is our fossil uh, tracing for this. All right now, we're gonna do the shell. I'm gonna use a different color this time. Let's do yellow. Let's try. No, I'll use green. Let's try green. Okay. So again, go over it lightly. Actually, this one you want to go in pretty hard, okay? So go in pretty hard with this one. So we went light with the leaf. We're going to go pretty hard with the shell. So press down when you go over it. my shell rubbing okay All right so I'm gonna pick seashell All right so here's my shell rubbing and here is my seashell rubbing okay so we just did fossil tracings now the questions that I have for you are 
what was the purpose of us doing two different kinds of fossils? So what was the point of us making this seashell fossil and making this leaf fossil the way that we did? So remember with the leaf, we, we only used tape. And then with the seashell, we used a butter knife and scissors. So what was the part what was the purpose of us doing two different um, forms of fossils? Also, look at how where these fossils are in their environment. Okay. Look at where the leaf is and look at where the seashell is. Okay. What are the differences? in their environment and why do you think that the seashell was not made the same way as the leaf now i'm going to have these same questions for you in google classroom and as an assignment that you need to be um that you need to be doing this by friday so i also want to see you make your leaf and your seashell fossil okay so i i made it with you I also want to see yours, and I also want to see your rubbings as well, okay? I want to see your leaf rubbing or some kind of plant rubbing, and I also want to see your uh, some form of uh, deep sea um, type rubbing as well, right? And then you need to answer these questions by Friday on Google Classroom. All right, I'll see you next video.